Hi gamers, how are you doing? I hope you're doing fine. Welcome to Shaja's short game news. In today's video I have 6 news items for you. Epic Games improves Swiss development with Unreal Engine 4.20 update. Zelda Breath of the Wild in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. 800 platinum points with Captain Troll Treasure Tracker. Will Super Smash Bros Ultimate get a demo? Is Arcane Studio developing a game for Nintendo Switch? And is the new Spyro game coming to Nintendo Switch? These are the news items for today, so stay tuned after the intro. Welcome to the Sarge Arcane's little boy. We got live streams and gameplays, little boy. Le level up, level up, Super Mario. Get crazy, man. W Wario. We about to take off, take over the whole planet. But my time is running out, so you better check the channel. We got a lot of information. Let's get it. You want all that information? Come get it. Yes, gamers. Let's start with the first news item for today. Epic Games has improved the Nintendo Switch development with the Unreal Engine 4.20 update. And there were tons of changes, features, improvements and much more added. Epic Games released tons of performance and memory improvements built for Fortnite on the Nintendo Switch to all Unreal Engine developers. And this includes the following. Support for dynamic resolution and temporal upsampling, better texture compression, pack buffer support for 1080p in dock mode and many other fixes. If you want to read everything, click on the link on this video. Alright, let's switch to the next news item. The beautiful and fun Mario Kart 8 Deluxe received a brand new update. What brings the game to version 1.6.0? And this update adds Champion's Tonic Link from The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. This update also adds the Master Cycle Zero from Breath of the Wild. Nintendo also uploaded a new trailer from the Breath of the Wild update in Mario Kart 8. And that's the trailer you see right now. A link is below for if you want to see the whole trailer. Mm, I don't mean Link from Zelda, so if you're thinking about finding him on this video, you will search for long. Alright gamers, let's switch to the next news item. To celebrate Captain Toad Treasure Tracker on the Nintendo Switch and 3DS, my Nintendo members can join the adventure with a special hide and seek mission to earn my Nintendo points. All you have to do is log into your my Nintendo account, then find all 4 pixel toes hidden in the official game website and earn 100 platinum points. Each pixel toad you find gives you 25 platinum points. If you don't know this game, download the demo in the eShop right now and give it a try. Talking about demos, the turn talks about possibility of Super Smash Bros Ultimate demos similar to ARMS and Splatoon 2. Bill Trennan said to EGN when EGN asked about a Smash Ultimate demo that right now they focus very much on getting the game ready. And that they have a few other things to talk about down the road between now and when the game launches in December. Sounds like that we're going to get a demo from Smash Ultimate for sure. Alright, let's switch to the next news item. The team behind Dishonored and Prey, Arcane Studios, are looking for developers. A job listing for an Arcane Studio engine programmer has recently appeared. One of the things they are looking for is no less of platformer SDK, PS4, Xbox One, Windows, Linux and for Nintendo fans, the Switch. So it looks like Arcane Studio is going to support the Switch. At this moment it's not sure what is being planned exactly, so we have to wait and see what they are developing for the Switch and the other platforms. Bethesda have a great relationship with Nintendo at this moment, so I bet that Arcane Studio is developing a game for the Switch. Alright gamers, let's switch to the last news item for today. The first time many gamers knows about that Spyro Reignited trilogy was coming, many of us said that this game would fit great on the Nintendo Switch. But at that moment there was no Nintendo Switch version coming. But now there are more evidence that Spyro also is coming to Nintendo Switch. The Trilogy's official website allows you to pre-order the game, where you can choose from a variety of platforms. And one of the platforms that can be selected, depending on the region, is the Nintendo Switch. If this all is true, what I think it is, we're going to get an official announcement soon for sure. Alright gamers, thank you for watching. I hope you like those news items. If you do, please like and subscribe for more. And let me know what you think about those news items. Have a great gaming day and great weekend of course, take care, be positive, see you next time, peace. Thanks for watching, thanks for your time, thumbs up for the video, comment and subscribe, you better hit the button, come and follow the tribe, but every few is love, so I'll see you next time, let's get it on.